Hey guys, what is up and welcome back to the channel. Before we get started, I want to wish each and every one of you a very, very happy 2021. Hopefully this year will be far less chaotic than the previous one. Anyway, I just wanted to wish you all a happy new year, hoping that you and all of your loved ones are keeping safe and healthy in these trying times. In this video, we're going to be taking a look at a few changes to Yuzu Emulator, both of these changes also having been merged to the mainline branch, which means it's available to everyone absolutely for free. The first of these changes is a pretty significant one. The brand new Texture Cache rewrite, which I covered in a video about three weeks ago, has now been merged to mainline, meaning that all of the benefits from it, including better rendering in games, much, much greater performance in lots and lots of games, and a ton of bug fixes are now available for everyone to use in these latest mainline versions. While I've shown you some of the highlights of that texture cache, if you wish to check out everything that has changed, or at least most of the major changes with it, you can find my full video on it linked down in this video's description, so check it out if you want to see what kind of differences you can expect to see. The second of the changes I'm going to be taking a look at in this video is the one mentioned in the title, one of the most requested games on my channel, Luigi's Mansion 3, has just received a performance boost that massively changes how this game plays on the emulator. Now previously, if you've ever played Luigi's Mansion on Yuzu emulator, you would have noticed some pretty significant performance drops in specific areas, most notably the waterways in Basement 2 or on Floor 12, though in general, performance in most areas of gameplay is going to be significantly improved thanks to this new change. To give you a quick little demonstration of what this fix has achieved, we're going to be taking a look at some gameplay snippets from this game running on the latest mainline version. On the left you can see we have the latest mainline, and on the right we have an old version of mainline that lacked this new update. Now it should be noted that Luigi's Mansion 3 natively on the Nintendo Switch is a 30 frames per second game, and while 30 was achievable on very, very high-end hardware, this was not the case for much, much lower end systems. This one specific area has almost doubled in performance thanks to this new change, however, things take an even more dramatic turn when we take a step into floor 12, one of the most demanding areas in game. Previously, this floor would run at between 4 to 6 frames per second. Bear in mind that the footage you're seeing on the right is running on my 5GHz 10700K, Comparing and contrasting this 4 to 6 frames per second to our 50 to 60 frames per second in our new update shows you just how dramatic a change this has made to the emulator. Utilizing this new fix is super super easy, all you need to do is come to emulation, configure your CPU tab, then make sure that instead of using accurate you are using unsafe, also making sure that on this latest update you have this inaccurate not a number handling option available to you. If you do not have this option in your CPU tab specifically labeled under unsafe, please make sure that you update to the latest version of Yuzu emulator, and for anybody who's looking for a way to set up this emulator, as always you will find my full and complete setup guide linked down in this video's description. By following this guide, you can be assured of getting the best possible performance on this Nintendo Switch emulator on your PC. Before I go, and on another note for this brand new year of 2021, I'd like to ask you guys whether or not you would like to see me upload more raw gameplay, specifically types of videos where I'd cover game performance and playability, also including stuff like the best settings for that specific game. Please let me know down in the comments section whether you would enjoy such videos. For now, I'm going to leave you with some extended gameplay of Luigi's Mansion 3, utilizing this brand new performance fix on top of all of the new graphical changes given to us by the brand new texture cache rewrite. Once again guys, thank you all very much for checking out this video, I greatly appreciate it. Before I go, I also want to give a massive, massive thank you to all of my Patreon supporters. Each and every one of you guys has been a massive, massive help to me throughout the past year, especially so in some very, very tough times. So to each and every one of you, I want to give a heartfelt thank you. If you would like to support me and my channel, please feel free to head on over to my Patreon page and pledge your support. Any and all support is greatly, greatly appreciated. That's going to be it for this video, guys. Sit back and enjoy this Luigi's Mansion 3 gameplay. As always, guys, remember to like this video if you liked it, dislike it if you didn't, and subscribe to the channel if you want to see all future videos from me.